Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Castlevania Circle of the Moon. Unfortunately, since last time, I recorded an episode and lost all of my progress because the video decided it was recording black. Just nothing but black. Yay. I just, here, I'm just getting these two upper spots in this room for exploration percentage purposes. It was 0.1% per tile. The bright side is, I know where I'm supposed to be going for this episode, uh, so it will not be much wandering around blindly. The downside is, I know where we're going, and it's not particularly fun. And this is not it. Yay for getting lost already, when I know what I'm supposed to be doing. Why do I feel like I'm hitting for so little damage? Just be these swords. Or these enemies. One of the two. And now I'm cursed. Why not? Let's just get out of here. How about that? And let's run into every other marionette along the way. That is, in fact, a dead end over there. We will end up going over there at some point in the future, so I'm not worried about it right now. Really? 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 Just stop. Okay, that works. Actually, where am I going? I need to go to the teleporter. Just quite a ways below me. So let's just keep going down. Still gotta go down. Yep, we're on the right track. I would love if this game had a little mini-map in the corner. Wait. Haha, <laughs> game, you almost tricked me. Almost. It's like you try to get me to pick up these stupid daggers all the time. And I finally did, and it actually worked out reasonably well. Just, uh... Alright, this is the beginning of the game. That door is locked. I already checked it. In the previous episode. Oh. The previous episode that no one will ever see because it kind of doesn't exist. Now, this is like the weird part of the game again. Yes, I will take that over the dagger. Uh, blah, 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 the weird thing. I don't know where I was going with that anymore. I forgot already. Uh, the weird thing about this part of the game, it's like, everything is easy to kill. And it's like, killing stuff does still give experience. But, I don't think it's worth actually killing these things. It's the, like, the time you sit, it's, they, yeah, they die in one hit. But it's like, oh, I, I'm gonna hit them, and then it's like, yeah... Unless you happen to, like, be in midair, sort of like this anyway, then it's worth it because you're not losing anything in the process. Kill these little skeletons, and nah, not worth it. Alright, there's a save point here that I definitely need to make use of. Alright, save the game. And now to proceed onward to our doom. That one, and I wish I was kidding. This is going to be the hardest area we have faced yet. How bad could it be, you ask? Well... I mean, it can't be too bad, right? Oh no, lava. Yeah, for poisonous water or something, I don't know. Very pale lava, if it is in fact lava. And these little switches are annoying.
And apparently I can hit them when they are behind me. These ice armors have way too much health. They're standing in lava, they should be melting. go I'm actually going to switch to is it done yet there it is okay to that and look we get to wait yet again the other problem with these guys is they will freeze you and when they freeze you it's pretty much to death because you're in lava and you take damage from the lava while you're standing in it. Or magma or whatever it is. Got a rock controller repeatedly. And up it goes. Will you come over here? No. Ah, uh, and I'm pretty sure I am dead right now. Now I'm definitely dead. This is the problem with this area. Unless intelligence or something to that effect will actually reduce the damage I take from it, maybe some ability I have, this could be worth looking into. Some card combination. One of those car combinations that doesn't appear to actually do anything. All right, we're in lava. Let's start with some equipment. Can I raise my defense? Yes, slightly. What armor? Let's just see if the defense changed anything. Would appear no. All right, miracle, miracle armband. You can go. Actually, we'll go to magic gauntlet for the moment. And where is that one? That's intelligence. A couple magic gauntlets. Also, no. Let's go back to wristband and... Miracle armband, and let's equip. I'm gonna go with, uh... Intelligence, definitely not helping. How about some of these card combinations? Okay, how about a working card combination? Let's see, nothing. Also, nothing apparently. Nothing. Well, that's a whip. this combination. No. Alrighty then. Well, this is the quickest way back to the save point. So apparently we're gonna have to do this very carefully, methodically, and just not die while attempting to do this. Seems easy enough. If only it actually were. This is still not the card combination I'm looking for. This one? I have my little fireballs. There they are. Alright, the goal here. Avoid going in lava. Oh yeah, there's this thing too. I found this last time. Just kind of never got it this point this time around. And more magic gauntlets. How not very helpful. Wait for the frickin' stairs to go up. And guess what we're gonna do now? We're gonna wait for the scares, stairs to go back down. How exciting is this? Gonna 
bait out a spear. There it is. And we'll just run up here quickly. Wait on the stairs yet again. This is not what I want to do. But that's definitely not what I want to do. That's definitely, definitely not what I want to do. And was that a 267 damage hit? Really? What the hell was that from? And I lost my little flamey wisps again. What else is new? I know where it is this time. There it is. And I'm already taking damage. So this is going to be the last time I do this on screen before I just go back to that one spot where I keep getting killed. I'll get the stupid heart max thing again. It's going to sneak by. Okay, these things all hurt a lot. Oh look, a magic gauntlet. It's quite possible that this is not where I'm supposed to be going currently. Now, they could intend me to go some other way, some other area, but I, I really don't know. This could just be the point where the game developers decide that, you know what, the game is too easy so far, so we're just gonna make it way more difficult than it already is, so... Yeah. There's the javelin, and we're clear of that guy. So I gotta jump over him and not get hit by him or his friend. Ah, I am going to die again. Nope, I didn't get that jump even really close. So I'll meet you back there in a moment. All right, here we go again. It's gonna work this time. It actually did. Hit the switch through his legs. His very skilled uh, whipsmanship. Gonna get the hell out of here. And apparently we're going down for the moment. Ah, uh, not good, not good, not good. Oh, I'm hitting it. Not okay. It's a little better than I thought it was. Going. Thought I was taking damage non-stop from lava. Or magma. Might have had that conversation with myself last time. Ooh, MP up. I so would have loved to have gotten health. Oh, brain floats. Well, I am now pretty sure that's what we're going to be getting next as an upgrade. Something to use those as ladders to climb up to new areas. No, keep, just keep running. Don't look. Stop. No, don't stop. I've got a whole one to two health left. One health exactly. This is not going to end well at all. Because I am pretty sure that on the other side of this, I need to take more damage. Wait, can I not be killed by that? Apparently I can. I don't know how I did not die instantly when I touched it. Be right back in a moment. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, up and over. That... Not what I want to do, but yay, and vulnerability frames in that particular case, not so much. That damage. Screw the facade, I am using save states from this point on to reload here. Because that run back is just annoying, this was not a particularly good run getting here. I am missing a decent little chunk of health, and I am about to die again. Alrighty then, let's try this yet again. 
Uh, yes, there we go. Hit the switch. Run away. Come on, let me run away. There we go. Jump over that javelin. That sucked. Alright, try this again. Oh, for the love of God. I, w I n really wouldn't do this if not for the fact that I'd already recorded an episode today, and I'm running short on time, and I'll have something worth actually uploading and stuff. I know, excuses, excuses, but whatever. Ooh, that was very good. Oh, I did it again? Really? I keep forgetting that one particular guy is there. Every single time. And it's just a hunch at this point, but it looks as if... I jump in the fire, and now, okay. I just disproved that theory very quickly. And I ran into frozen shade. Kinda wanna find, like, a save point or something. Got a couple more minutes in this episode, I, th I guess. Uh, screw this. Load most recent. Get the mouse off the screen. Oh, look at that. That doesn't work. Okay, I can get hit from behind and then kills horribly. One. Okay, down, swing between his legs, get ready to get the hell out of here before I get hit. Oh, really? I, I really just can't win. And I did it again. Alright, last shot for this episode. I'm just gonna call it a day. Alright, switch is activated. And I got javelined again. And I'm dead. Screw it. One more time. Cause that pissed me off. One more, one more time. One more successful attempt, that's what's gonna be, and this is not going to be it. Because I'm calling a do-over. It's like, so far so good on the whole, uh, you know, no save state of- no. No. Bad game. Alright, there we go. Switch is hit. Alright, there we go. Gotta, oh no! Are you kidding me? It's like, oh yeah, no, just be careful here not to hit, jump on that guy again. And look what happened anyway. Alright, this is gonna actually be the last time though. And we'll just... I didn't double jump. Ugh. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode of Let's Play Castlevania Circle of the Moon. Next time, we'll stop abusing save states, except for the initial time when I'm going to go off of that last state, because that's going to be my save for the end of the episode. Anyway, thanks for watching. Feel free to comment, rate, and subscribe, and have a great day.